It's so funny. I remember the day when um, Keenan and I were having a conversation back in 2014, and Keenan had walked in, walked into my office and said, "Hey, Dad, um, you know, I've been working with this company, and I realize that's not something I want to do for the rest of my life." I said, "What's that?" He said, um, "Hauling heavy things." Where you started is not where you are right now. When we start on our entrepreneurial journey, we all come from different backgrounds and different experiences. But one thing I love hearing about is where people were before they started on their entrepreneurial journey. In today's video, I'm gonna show you the place where all of my thoughts came to a head. All of my dissatisfaction with my nine to five really started to brew up inside me and cause me to go all in on my passion of entrepreneurship. So I thought this was the most appropriate place to start this journey with you, in the car. In the summer of 2013, when I was working at my first job, I was realizing that I wasn't happy. I was spending my time, my resources, but most importantly, my passion, working for somebody else and not really getting the fulfillment that I was looking for out of it. And so as I was taking those long drives to work in the morning, I was constantly thinking about, what can I do to make myself happy? What can I invest my time in to give a lifestyle for myself and my family that I know would bring fulfillment? And it just wasn't this. Well guys, this is where it all started for me. All those days of driving here early in the morning to this employer, Maccabee Office Environments. So this is where my entrepreneurial dream started. It started here because I was spending all of these days in the hot Las Vegas summer moving office furniture around. And one day I had a conversation with one of the veteran guys here, his name was Dion, and he talked about how if I just waited another 90 days, another 120 days, next summer, I'd be making better money. And in that moment, I really realized that this was not for me. I realized that if I was gonna be happy, if I was gonna be able to create a lifestyle for myself, one that fulfilled me, that I could pour my passion into, then I was gonna to have to make drastic changes. And this is where my entire entrepreneurial journey started. Like so many other entrepreneurs, I know we have stories of summer jobs, we have stories of working at a place where we couldn't feel passionate to give all of our energy. And those type of experiences shifted everything. This shifted everything for me. And being able to look back now, nine years later, and think about how far I've come is a really surreal experience. And I just wanna thank everybody who I worked with in this place because you guys taught me so many different lessons. You taught me so many things about what I wanted, but more importantly, what I didn't want. And I wouldn't be able to have such an important voice to be able to talk about important conversations like mental health or other things like that if I wouldn't have started here. So I would love to know, where has your entrepreneurial journey taken you and where did you start from? Just like how I started at Maccabee Office Environments, I'm sure you had a story of working at a hotel at 7-Eleven at some job that you weren't incredibly passionate about and that experience in itself opened new doors towards entrepreneurship for you. I'd love to hear what your experience was. Let me know down in the comments.